Hey guys, my name is Pizza. Welcome back to another video. Today we're going to be looking at the 11.10 cosmetics that just got leaked pretty recently. And I'm pretty sure that all of these, uh, or at least the majority of these leaks, were leaked by either Hypex or Lucas7Yoshi over on Twitter. Um, so if you're going to go check them out, those are their ads, Lucas7Yoshi and Hypex. They're the usual leakers who leak a lot of the main stuff. And uh, like I said in the last couple of videos, since these are Halloween based, or the last couple of leak videos since these are Halloween based, I really like a lot of the skins they're doing for this Halloween. I think they look really nice, and I'm, I'm really enjoying the art style that they're going for with some of these skins. So uh, yeah, we're just going to go ahead and get into it. And also, if you see some of the squares here that say like placeholder outfits, I don't know why those are there at all, but um, yeah, just ignore those, I guess. But first... And uh, also after this, we have some zoomed in images or uh, in-game images of some of these skins. So don't worry, you will see more than just, you know, the, the image of the skin here on the front. So first, we have Deadeye, which I think looks amazing. And the title or the description is Bounty Hunter from Beyond the Grave, which it's going to be 2,000 V-Bucks apparently. With the second sight, I guess, uh, back bling, is it what it is? Yeah, it's watching you. Which I don't really like the back bling that much, but the actual skin... I think looks really sick. I really like it a lot. I like how, you know, there's the bright, luminescent, I guess, stuff going on around it, which looks really nice. Next, we have the Hemlock skin, which has two different styles. And I think this skin has, yeah, two different styles, one with the hat and one without the hat. Very nice. Hemlock, the future is witchy, part of the Arcane Arts set, which I don't know if we have any skins from that yet, but I think we might. Not too sure. But it's basically a witch, and then it has another uh, version of it, or a second uh, style where it's like a werewolf witch thing. I don't know. Pretty cool. It reminds me a lot of, uh, I forgot what the skin was called, but it's from the season eight battle pass. I bet you guys know what I'm talking about where the girl has fire in her hands and it looks really cool. Reminds me a lot of that skin. This one can be 1500 V bucks. I'm pretty sure. So pretty nice. We have the witchcraft, uh, emote here, which I'm not sure if we have in-game footage of that yet or not, but I'll check and see. Share your magic. Part of the arcane art set. Once again, very nice. Bag of Shadows, stylish, stylishly dreary. Once again, going to be the back bling with the hemlock skin. Then we have the armory bag, part of the high caliber gear. We'll probably see the skin that goes with that in a second. The zombie backboard, which is the gold trooper. Very cool. Uh, the mastermind backboard. Uh, yeah, backboard. Very cool. Uh, I haven't used that back bling in a while, but it's actually one of my favorites. So that's pretty cool. And then we have the uh, phantom back bling. Or not backling, backboard. Nosh backboard. Oh my god, I can't see. Backboard. Uh, the Halloween backboard. Very cool. I like all the backboards. They all look cool. The Merry Mint Axe, which I think looks really, really sick. I like it a lot. I might buy it. Not too sure. Part of the Frosty Flight. Or Frosty Fights, not Frosty Flights. Um, looks very nice. Very Halloween-ish. Very cool. We have the Haze skin here, which I'm guessing is going to be 1200 V-Bucks. I'm guessing. Two different styles once again. Part of the Dark Star on the Rise, or a Dark Star on the Rise, part of the Midnight Star set. Then we have the Surf Rider, very cool. Protect the Beach is part of the Aqua Marine set. Wake Rider, part of the same set as the previous skin, Conquer the Coast. Looks very nice, I like it a lot. Very basic. I'm guessing these are going to be 800 V-Bucks, uh, the Aqua Marine set. Then we have the Trench Raider, Under the Waves and Out for Vengeance, part of the Fan Fathoms Deep set. We have the Bush Ranger, which I think is what a lot of people are going to be buying just because of how much you can meme it, I guess you could say. Um, he's one of the scrappy little tree, or he's one the I, I literally can't speak today, I'm sorry guys. Um, part of the Woozy set, very nice skin, very, uh, uh, I guess you could say cute skin, like the uh, banana skin, peely, you know, very cool. And then we have the Riley skin here. The city is her playground, part of the streets spirit set. We have Wrath, which I think we've seen already, so I don't know why that's here. Uh, but there's different styles for it. Purple, green, red, which I didn't know before. The Ridgeback Back Bling, part of the Midnight Star set, so that would go with uh, Haze, right here, right above it. We have the Short Wave, almost waterproof. Uh, so I guess that's a, the Back Bling for the Surf Rider. And then this is the Back Bling for this, uh, the Wake Rider. Then we have the Torpedo Tank, that goes with the Trend Trader. And then we have the Buzzy Bag, which is basically a hive or honeycomb, whatever you want to call it, uh, that goes with the Bush Ranger. Very cool. And then also with that is the Honey Hitters. And then we have the Death Charger that goes with uh, the Fa Fathom <laughs> Fathoms Deep Set. And then we have the Storm King Fist that goes with the uh, 
I'm actually not sure which one that one goes with, but it looks very nice. Then we, this is my favorite pickaxe from the set, the Spectral Scythe. I think I'm gonna have to get that one. That This one looks just too cool to pass up, honestly. The Witchia Axe, very cool. Part of the Arcane Arts. Uh, the different backlings here for the Wrath skins. Ghostly, goes with Riley, I guess. Uh, then we have the Witchy Wrap, looks okay. Dead Wave, I like that one a lot. Octo, pretty cool. Storm King Music, which I'm guessing is gonna be from the uh, Fortnite Mayors event that's happening. I think it, it might happen today. I forgot when exactly it happens, but yeah. Pump It Up Emote, Fright Funk Emote, Star Shot Pickaxe, Dual Filet Pickaxe, Piranhas Pickaxes. Um, then we have the Wetsuit Wrap. Looks very basic. Wild X Wrap. Looks pretty cool. I like that one. Very basic. Eek Emote, or I, I don't know exactly what those are called. The Final Reckoning Waiting uh, Lobby Loading screen, I think that's what it's called. Hit the road, looks pretty cool. King's Wrath, Spreading Chaos, and the Storm Sail uh, Glider or Umbrella, which I think looks really, really nice. Probably one of the best umbrellas we've had. I really like this season's Victory Umbrella, but this one also looks really, really sick. So, would not complain for getting that one, honestly. That one looks really nice. So now, we're going to go look at some of these skins but in a better or clearer image or an actual in-game image real quick. Here we have the Surf Rider zoomed in of the image, so you can get a better look of it if you want to see that. And I think this is the... I think this is the Wake Rider. Or, if, yeah, the Wake Rider. Then we have... Uh, I forgot what skin this was called, but uh, a lot of people are kind of complaining that they don't really like this skin because it's just like a waypoint style, basically, and there's not really much effort put into it. Like, it's a pretty lazy skin, but in my opinion, I kind of like some of the more basic skins, because like a lot of backlings can go with them, but if you have super, super, super complex skins, there's not really many backlings that you can put with them that look great, so sometimes it's nice to have some of these basic skins, but I can understand why other people are complaining about getting some of these more basic skins for the Halloween skins, I guess. Here we have the Deadeye skin, which is probably one of my most favorite skins from this 11.10 uh, leak set. This one looks really cool. Um, just I already said it before, but I, I like this one a lot. It's one of the more like my favorite basic skins like there's obviously a lot of stuff going on with it but it's more basic than some of the other skins we've seen before that i like a lot so pretty cool to see those and it's also not too bulky because a lot of skins that i normally end up liking end up being pretty bulky skins uh, which can end up obviously being a disadvantage in game but you know just looking at it pretty cool i like it i think this is the witch skin that we saw in the previous leaks page uh i'm not sure though because it, it looks a little bit different i thought the other skin had like black clothing but i might be wrong uh once again, it's an okay skin, not my favorite from the set, uh, but it is still pretty okay, pretty nice. I, I like the whole Halloween spirit and everything, so I get pretty hyped up for almost any Halloween skin they put out here, so that's pretty nice. One skin, another zoomed in image of the skin, pretty basic one. This one I think is only going to be like 800 or 1200 at the max, so uh, yeah, pretty basic. I, the horns are okay, I, I, I feel like that's the only unique thing that's really going on with the skin, but other than that, I like... it's. All red, so there's probably gonna be a lot of backlings that go with it, you know, red and black. Uh, probably like the red knight backling or shield would go really, really well with this. Um, and I bet there's gonna be a lot of people out there who use that combo. And uh, yeah, pretty nice skin though. And lastly here we have the bush ranger skin, which reminds me, obviously because it's birch wood that he's kind of made out of, but it reminds me a lot of the Minecraft trees because obviously Minecraft has the birch wood trees. And then it looks like they just put a Fortnite bush in the middle, put a face on it, and that's it, which I think looks really cool. And I, I think it's really funny how on his sash he has grenades that are made out of pine cones. Uh, which I, at first I thought they were just normal pine cones, but then I looked closer and they were actual grenades. So I thought that's, that was really funny. Uh, I don't think this is a Halloween themed skin. I think this is just, you know, a random one, but I like it. I think it looks really funny, really cool. And uh, I bet a lot of you guys are going to like it also. And I bet this is going to be one of the most bought skins in this set. Uh, when it eventually comes out. Maybe it'll actually come out tonight. Who knows? We'll see. Well, anyways, guys, if you enjoyed this video, make sure to drop a like down below. Leave a comment of what your favorite skin was from this set or what your favorite item was from this set. Subscribe if you haven't already. Turn on those notifications. See whenever I have a new video out. And uh, yeah, make sure to go check out my media links in the description, Discord, Twitter, second channel, all that stuff. And uh, yeah, thank you so much for watching. I'll see you all in the next one. Goodbye.